let's take a look now at cell planning with 802.11ac and what does that mean to you in your enterprise environment. So traditionally a lot of enterprises would have deployed in this traditional approach as you can see here illustrated where you'd use a one in three frequency reuse so you'd have using frequency one here, two and three and then you'd reuse the frequency over here and so you'd need to have a minimum of three channels. So if you're deploying AC with an 80 megahertz channel, that would be three times 80 megahertz. So you'd need to have at least that amount of spectrum available. Now, if you wanted to go to a 160 megahertz channel, then you'd need three times 160 megahertz if you still wanted to use the one in three frequency reuse plan. And in most countries around the world, you just don't have that spectrum available including here in North America. So one of the options that you're going to see becoming more dominant as we go forward to really leverage off 802.11ac is you're going to see deployments which are actually using a one-channel deployment like you see with Maru Networks. And that way you can deploy in all of your cells the same 160 megahertz channel or the same 80 megahertz channel or potentially going down the road maybe overlaying multiple 80 megahertz channels and so really exciting to rethink how you're doing your cell planning going forward to take advantage of these new technologies as they're emerging.